welcome to another episode of Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2. So I'm in the menu system here. I'm very much a, uh, well, beginner level, not um, a great deal of equipment. So I'm going to be setting up this setup, this little setup here. Um, if you watched my previous video, I asked you guys on the lake I was on, I'm not going to try to pronounce that lake, I'll put it up on the screen now and we're going to head off to that lake anyway. Um, on the lake I was on, what are you guys using to catch these big fish? Anyway, Greg came back and replied, hashtag five carp hook and corn. Now I've got pretty much basic equipment here, I've just set it up there, hopefully I've got the right hook. And uh, we're going to head off now to this lake and see... If I can catch or beat my personal best. So, Greg, this is all down to you. I don't know how this is going to go. We will see. This is Greg's fishing tip. And this is my first go using corn on this hashtag five carp hook. Hopefully I've got the right one. I may be I maybe not have the right one. I don't I don't know, but we're gonna give it a try and see if I can beat my personal best. I haven't got into the doubles yet, so if I can get a 15 pounder, I'll be more than happy. Um, or the 15 pound anything, but a carp would be great. So uh, yeah, previous video, I asked for your tips and hints on this lake. And Greg, so far, is the only one who came back with an answer. So uh, let's see what we can catch. Okay, got a bit of a funny noise coming through my headset. Hopefully it's not going to spoil the video too much and hopefully it may go away. I don't know if it's because I've just gone into this view, but uh, we'll see. Ah, I think it's gone. I think that uh, well, I've got some static on the line or something there. Don't know what that was about. Oh, boom, we're in. Fish on. Now, was that a carp? It looked like a carp. Let's see what we've got on the corn here. Now, I'm using the feeder rod. I think this is the feeder rod you start off with, don't you, in the game. As you start as a beginner, you start off, I think, with two rods. The feeder rod and the float rod. Well, that floater rod, I kept snapping. Kept breaking it. And um, I went onto the feeder rod. And you can float fish on the feeder. And I find it, I find it a lot better rod. Uh, don't know if that's correct. I've no idea. But uh, anyway, I started using the feeder rod for the float fishing found it just slightly better anyway that's my thoughts anyway um, but yeah let's see what we got on it looks like we got a good fish on here fish on the corn Well, I don't know what it is we've got on here. It did look like a carp. Could be a rather big one, but I just don't know because at this point in the game, I haven't really had any big fish. It's a bit of a fighter. Could be here a while. Then again, maybe not. Nope. Pulling away again. Nearly snapped the line as well. Have to watch that. I think we got nine. Did, was it nine pound line I put on? Don't know if I got the correct line on here. I struggle a little bit with the lines and things in this game and the uh, the rigs and everything. I'm not uh, I'm not that familiar with Ultimate Fishing Simulator, but I have just really started to get into Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2. I'm while I'm basically grinding away on it in my spare time. Don't forget, if you want to uh, support the channel, smack that like button. Say hello in the comment section below. If you've got any hints and tips, oh, I nearly snapped the line again. Put them in the comment section below. I'll have a look at them, and if I can have a go at them, bearing in mind what level I'm on and what equipment I'm on, I will 
give them a go I might even give you a mention on the channel And if you've discovered this video and this channel for the very first time, basically what I do on this channel, it's just gameplays. I just play the games, um, play the games, playthroughs, let's plays, that sort of thing. Some with commentary, some without. Um, and a few, hopefully, live streams. I'm not trying to sell you any of the games. I'm just, uh, I'm just pointing the games up, playing them, and it's up to you guys if you like the games or not. Simple as that. But this looks like a beast, a beast of a fish. Could be here a rather long time. If I begin to walk down the bank here, because this game gives you a large amount of freedom, you're not stuck in one place, uh, can I get closer to the fish and land it? Let's try and get on that platform there, but I just couldn't, I just couldn't get on it. I think you've got to jump up on it, so I'm not going to risk losing the fish. This is the first time, I think, using the corn as well. I've never used the corn before. Going to be interesting to see. Oh, don't snap the line. Panic moment. I really struggle on the tension and the reel uh, with using the keyboard. Just got to get used to it. What a beast of a fish this could be. I wonder what it is. Again, this tip came in from a viewer. They put, you know, try the corn. Put it in the comment section. Fierce cast. <laughs> Come on. What appears to be a rather big fish. I hope it's not a roach. Anyway, it didn't look like a roach, did it? It looked like a carp. I'm not going to go into the underwater camera. I don't want to spoil the illusion. I just want to I want to see what we've got. When I, oh, nearly snapped the line again. Yes. Oh, have we got him? We could have him right here. We could have him. No. Pulling away again. Just can't get this fish anywhere near the bank at all. I reckon if it was on that float rod, I would have snapped it by now. I think this rod's a little bit better. Oh, don't snap the line. I'm going to lose this. I'm going to end up snapping the line. I can see it. If I, if I snap the line, I will not be very happy. Pressure's on to get this fish in. It did look like a carp, so this could be my first double coming out of this lake. And if that's correct, this will be a personal best for me. Because I've only caught the small ones. I 
Right, let's uh, kind of run up here. He's a bit close to the bank then. He was he was in close to the margins up here. If I run up here, will he? Uh, can we get it? I don't know. We'll have a go. No, he's gone down that way. Right, let's run back down here. No. <laughs> oh dear. Could be here a long time. How long have we been playing this fish now? About 10 minutes. I don't be too aggressive on it because the line, I just know the line will snap. Go and try and get round where that jetty is and see if I can land this beast of a fish. This beastie of a fish. Getting close to it now. Might be able to pull it in here. Give it a go. Oh no, I can't go forward anymore. I'm stuck. <laughs> God, what am I stuck on? Ah, oh, there we go. I can't walk in front of the tree for some reason. I don't want to walk around the tree because if it was real life, I know I can walk around the tree, but if it was real life, they just couldn't get, you just couldn't do that, could you? Because your line would get uh, caught on the uh, on the tree there. So uh, I'll try play it realistically. Don't know why I couldn't walk in front of the tree. I must have got, uh, must be a big rock or something. Oh, don't snap the line. Must be a big rock or something on the floor. Have we got him now? Nearly snapped the line there again. Need to concentrate. Really damn put too much tension on this. Because I just know I'll lose it. I don't want to snap the rod as well. Look at the bend in the rod. Oh, but <laughs> I've never snapped this rod yet. Not this one. I don't think I'm going to get this in. Oh, have we got him? Saying that, have we got him? No. Have we? Could have. Could get him, right? No, he's staying out there. I wish I could get on that jetty, but I can't walk in front of that, in front of the tree there. I can walk behind the tree, but you wouldn't be able to do that in real life, would you? Well, you would if you swapped your hand over, wouldn't you, with the rod, but uh, no. I'll stay here. I could walk around that tree in real life if you uh, held the rod in one hand and then passed it round with the other, I suppose. But uh, this is a video game. Not bad on the simulation side, though, is it? Physics, uh, physics are pretty good. It's hugging that, uh, that jetty over there. I've got a feeling I'm going to lose this. No, oh, hang on, no, have we got him? He's coming in. I think we've got him. I think we've got him, right? Oh, have we got him? Could have him. Get ready with the net. This could be a big one. Oh, we've got him, we've got him, we've got him. What have we got? Let's have a look what we've got. Oh, look at that. Absolutely fantastic. It's a 28 pounder, just 28 pounder, just under 29 pound, but it's a 28 pound carp. Absolutely, it's a new personal best, obviously. Uh, absolutely fantastic. Well, thanks to Greg. First go on the corn, on that particular hook, I forgot the right one. I'm taking loads of screenshots here, I am, <laughs> for the albums, I should do. That's the biggest fish I've had 
yet to present not only in this lake but on any other lake I've been on I've not caught anything bigger than, than that yet absolutely fantastic keep them tips coming in i think greg deserves a big thumbs up he gave he you know it's thanks to greg that this video has come to you today with this tip absolutely fantastic greg deserves a big thumbs up wow look at that that's it folks that's fishing absolutely fantastic i can't take enough screenshots by the way but uh, I'm going to keep him. If I catch enough of them, I'm going to be getting in loads of money, aren't I? Got quite a bit of money for that one. But, uh, yep. That's the setup. That's the setup I used. You might if you uh, if you're going to ask me what I used. But uh, you might need to pause the video. As I'm going through this quite quickly. If you're interested in the uh, setter setup. And the corn, thanks to Greg and his tips. Well, that's it. That's fishing, folks. Thanks for watching.